Nearly 25 years, a massive patriotic mission has put old glory on display. It started with just 200 flags around one Irving home. The great flag caper has now stretched to include 40,000 flags planted all over the city. And this year, its founder says its mission is more important than ever. The new recruits are, are so assembled. Excited. Who's here for the first time, volunteering for the first time? Joining an army of over 300 strong. And who's excited for the 4th of July? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Brought together by their fearless leader, Nell Ann Hunt, and his shared mission. Our theme is always, we don't live in America, America lives in us. Every year ahead of the 4th of July. A thousand, yeah, right, thousand. yeah. Hunt ships out patriotism by the box full. Stacks of American flags line her porch, home, and backyard so they can line neighborhoods across Irving and the 10 and a half mile stretch of MacArthur Avenue. And to me, it's a symbol of unity. We're all one great American city. I like to think we're the hometown of patriotism. The seed of patriotism planted by her parents, who were part of the greatest generation. My mother always said that uh, she woke up every morning and thanked God that she was born in the United States in the 20th century. Every year, more volunteers sign up for the great flag caper. Here, here, I'll take this bundle. Okay, everybody got a bundle? New faces as young as two years old join the regulars. In divisive times, Hunt says this year the mission is even more important. There's a lot of uh, fear and, and a lot of hate in our country for the first time that I can remember. She hopes shared values will be the stitch that holds America together. This project is all about kindness and all about valuing every single person in this country. A message not lost on the smallest of volunteers. Have peace for America. Respect America. From the mountains to the prairies. 40,000 flags, 300 volunteers, one country. God bless America. On a field of old glory. And after planting all of those flags, volunteers get together for a patriotic potluck dinner, a tradition attended by over 100 people, and the flag lady describes it as a Norman Rockwell event. What a great event out there, and so much patriotism in that neighborhood. Ten and a half miles of flags, we were talking about it. That's a whole lot of flags, but yeah. anything for this country. Exactly. On July 4th, so right? much pride and so good to see. Yeah. Well,